Hi guys, welcome back to our channel and in today's video we are going to balance this equation where we have butane and oxygen on the reactant side and CO2 and H2 on the product side. Basically it's a butane combustion reaction and to balance this we are first going to look at the number of atoms for both reactant and product side. For reactant side we have 4 carbon atoms, 10 hydrogen atoms and 2 oxygen atoms. For product side we have 1 carbon atom. 2 hydrogen atoms and 2 plus 1, 3 oxygen atoms. Now to start balancing this equation, I am going to start and balance carbon atoms on both the sides first. Here we have 4 carbon atoms on the reactant side but only 1 on the product side. So for fixing this, I am going to add 4 as a, co as a coefficient and as a result we will have 4 carbon atoms on both reactant and product side. Similarly, we will proceed ahead and we will, uh, we will try to balance out these hydrogen atoms. We have 10 hydrogen atoms on the reactant side but only 2 on the product side. So I am going to place uh, coefficient 5 to balance this off and now we will have 10 atoms of hydrogen on product side as well. Now this will also change the number of atoms for oxygen and we can calculate that. So on reactant side we have 8 plus 5 that is 13 oxygen atoms and for reactant side we only have 2. Now to balance it off I have to actually multiply this by 13 by 2 as it will cancel out this 2 and there will be 13 oxygen atoms. You can do that but if you do not want to go with a fraction and if you want to have a whole number because some people prefer having whole numbers in this equation is to multiply this entire equation by 2 and as a result there will be only whole numbers in this reaction. So as a result uh, if you put 2 over here the atoms of carbon, hydrogen and oxygen will change on both the sides. So um, you can do that if you multiply 2 uh, you will have 8 carbon atoms on the reactant side and it would be the same for the product side as well and the entire number of atoms will change. The equation is going to remain the same it is just that to avoid this uh, fraction situation we are actually multiplying this entire equation by 2. So you can put 2 uh, before C4 H10 and there will be a 2 before this one as well but as this 2 will cancel up we will have 13 O. Instead of 4 over here we will have 8 CO and instead of 5 over here we will have 10 H2O. So basically we have multiplied this entire equation by 2 and as a result this is the balanced equation for the butane combustion and I hope this video helps you to understand that. For more such videos on Lewis structure, molecular geometry, polarity of the molecules make sure to subscribe to our channel and thank you for watching.